Calder, with your permission, we will now return to Asa. Soon, I have need for you still. Asa's warriors, where do they fit into all this? You are one of our captains, yes? A duty I share with two others here. I thought I saw something in you. Stout, resolute. Step over here. Sigrun and Halstein were two of the most revered sons of Ivaldi. And such prestige is a requirement for these rituals. And Calder is surely luring that Muspel to his death. I wonder if there's a way I can observe the ritual up close. I need to approach Calder without him taking notice. Perhaps the best way is with deception. Come, join me, chosen ones. Together. We will exact Sudan's will, and who among you will hold?
and chased off the Kelda like a rabid hound. Ace and chased off the Kelda like a rabid hound. He is no helpless rabbit. What signs would I find of this pursuit? These fools stared stand in her path. Freya wonders why I have always refused to take her on a tour of that scorched dunghill. Asa and Calda fought here. Blood was spilt. Two sets of footprints. One is stretched, like someone fled. The other closer together, uneven and lined with blood. They were hobbling, perhaps. And Calder fought here. He gained the advantage. Foolish girl. Asa, your rage makes you vulnerable. She's hurt, but not enough to stop her. Looks like she followed Calder up that hill. attention here. Dead stack up. For these misspells, Ragnarok came early. chased Kelder into this camp, leaking her lifeblood, blinded by rage, utterly reckless. <sighs> Looks to have cost her too. 
She came crashing in, mauling whatever half-wit stood between her and Calder. Those half-wits fought back in numbers. Injured and disarmed, she was overpowered and restrained. Calder then had her toes onto a cart like a sack of turnips. Looks like they fled up that path. What is it Calder plans to do with the little princess now that she is his prisoner? Surely not. These tracks lead west. I must find Calder and the Zelikor. For both the sake. Is that you again, mad one? Come to tempt fate, I see. I do not die this day. Can you say the same? <laughs> ah, yes. You've proven once already how you like to strut around, unencumbered by fear. Perhaps a summer car did not give you an adequate taste of it. Enough of this blithering. Hand over what is now mine, or shall I just take it? To no fear, we must be subjected to it. When I am through with you, I will take Asa's willful ogre. Soon after, the Salakar will be complete. Then, believe me, you will know fear and pain. Just like your son. Sutra collecting hookahs. What does he mean to do with the Salakar? Tell me! And he won't have to. His secrets are known to me now. You want them? Move aside. Move aside, or I will destroy it. Traitor! Traitor? It is you who are slaughtering your own kind. What I do, I do for Suta. Such devotion requires a strong Hugar. All these Muspel sacrifices, 
You need it only look inward. Was he right? About you wanting to complete the Salakar? Sutra will not trade my son for something he cannot use. So you will see it through? To what end? How many lives would you take? For Balder, I would drain all nine realms. Even Asgard. The words of a dreadful king. And a selfless father. It is the one thing that separates you from my own. You wish to reunite with your son. I wish to see my father's plans lie in ruin. No matter the price. Can you see both through? I can. But I will need your help. The Salakar still requires the Hooger of a suitable Jotun. Kalta never found one. I must get hunting. Do as you will. In the meantime, I'll join my stepmother, wherever she may be. I will try to learn how the Salakar fits into my father's plans. Under the guise of a contrite stepdaughter, of course. Keep it. I will need a way to find you when it is time to confront my father. You and this Barvel share a bond. I set out to use you to my advantage. But it ends with me in your debt. If it were not for you, I would have never known what my father was capable of. He used our people. Turned them on each other. For his gain. I cannot forgive him. And to that end, I am your ally. In Asgard, an ally is a friend. Let us not get carried away. to humiliate us some more? Help me, and I'll compose your saga so exalted it will endure Ragnarok itself. But first, I need a name and a place. For what? For whom? The mightiest Jotun in all of Svartalfheim. We know the one. Right hand of Sjotungur. Malviger. Here because of us. She is... worthwhile. Gave your son Vidar quite the beating once, didn't she? One day Vidar will make me proud. But why would Malviga care about you two? Premier and Lom aren't our real names. <laughs> Allow me to introduce... Fiala and Gala. The ones who killed... Sutinger's father. I heard something about him trying to outdrink a couple of dwarfs. And after, befuddled, tripping and breaking his neck. <sighs> Sutinger wasn't happy. Held us responsible. But luckily we'd acquired some meat. 
some special weed. And well, Sutinger is partial to a bit of meat. We bartered it in exchange for our lives. Except afterwards, some thieving twat went and stole it. Loki, most likely. It's always Loki. Whoever it was, Sutinger didn't catch them. So he decided to take it out on us instead. Sent Malviga to hunt us down. Been incognito ever since. Can't trust this lot not to sell us out. Still, she hasn't found us yet. She will. Malviga's dangerous prey, even for you. But we can help balance the scales. At our old house, north of here. Sunk in a lake. Inside, upstairs on a table. You'll find a cup of great potency. Cup? You know, the cup. Oh, yes. The cup. Has the power to do wonderful stuff. For instance. So, I bring you the cup, and then. We show you how to use it against Malviga. It's a deal. This much is all. Well, no one can steer us. Well, the guardians have to carry us into the. Stretch your wings, Sunan. stolen it, assuming there was a cup in the first place. I need your eyes.
best to leave one of your enemies alive, so they can tell of your greatness. Everyone knows of my greatness. Perhaps there are one or two who have not yet heard? Just tell me where Malviger is. What... what's in it for me? I do not know, but I will tell you this. The longer you make me wait, the worse it will be. <sighs> Malviger is at the dam to the west. And now? Will you spare me? Until next we meet. <laughs> there will be no next. You can be sure of that.
Where's the dam? This tempest. It is unnatural. These rugged views that remind me of when I once roved the land with Freak. The cool nights spent together beneath the stars. She enjoyed the solitude as much as I. And the trouble and danger even more. And then came the war. What trickery is this? These rugged views that remind me of when I once roved the land with Freak. The cool nights spent together beneath the stars. She enjoyed the solitude as much as I. And the trouble and danger even more. And then came the war. King Freya was a bride. It helped in that strife, but it ended many other things too. So, the traitors have been betrayed. They had hoped that by serving you up, I would show them mercy. Clearly a misapprehension on their part. Yet here I am, served up. If I were here for you, Hyrule, I would have brought an army. No, Sutengard will have his vengeance, but not here. I know why you have come. I have a bone to pick with you. After what you did to my son, Vidar, I must... Vidar put up an honorable fight. That is not what I heard. Do not believe the stories. Upon his return, too weak to stand, he squirmed like a worm caught in the sun. <laughs> you should have seen me. My acolytes had to carry me home on their backs. No. Your boy fought well. Is that why you spared his life? It is. But you aren't here to avenge Vidar's honor. You have come to steal my Hugar. And I intend to stop you. How do you know this? Esir. Jotun. You and Loki are both mad. And Hirokin. He's just as bad. And Thor? He's so stupid he might as well be mad. You spread chaos wherever you go. Yet, you are all known quantities to us. Surtur is not. He rarely emerges from Muspelheim. And when he does, he shares little with us. Thus, while here, I have sent my spies to learn what he plans. Beyond wiping out the dwarves like he did the elves of Alvain. What do you know of his plans? I know that he found a powerful elven relic, and that his minion, Calder, was tasked with finding the hookers necessary to sustain it. That Calder is now trapped within said relic, and that you would have me join him. I must trade the Salakar for my son. You? The one who almost killed Sutengard for his meat? We'll hand over a legendary relic, take your son and leave. Just like that. <laughs> Put your mania aside, Havi. Work with me. Together we will foil Surtur's ambitions. I cannot take the risk. With each breath, Baldur is a step closer to death. I was a parent once. But we must look beyond ourselves, for the good of all. We have spoken long enough. So... I get to the portal! Come! Inflict a fate worse than death on me, or die trying!
Do what you came here to do. Get on with it, blind one. End my misery. Oh, Ymir. True, oh father. My body comes to you. Sent by the same imposter who claimed your own. As for my Hugar, do not weep for me. I do not deserve this. No, you do not.